Tuna, you're a blogger at Learning Bird Cafe, and welcome to episode two of Learning Bird Cafe. Um, today, we'll be making vegetarian corn dog bites. What you're going to need here is your vegetarian sausage. You're going to need your corn flour or regular flour. You're going to need your egg batter. And you're going to need one fourth cup of your oil. And make sure that you get your pot good and hot. And what you're going to do first is I'm going to take the oil over to my pan. Pour it in there. Make sure it's what I like to do here is what I've learned from other shows is especially um, the two which I love to watch them is, is the what the batter is called February or well, we call it February. Um, what you do is you take your your egg, your 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 sausage side. You dip it in the flour, like so, as you can see. Make sure you, and then you into the egg mixture, and then you back into your flour. And then into the pan. And then we'll do that one more time. Just keep on doing that. And you can also, a great tip as well is you can also do this in the in the Ziploc bag. And then you take it and put it into your mixture, your egg mixture, and back into your flour. And you want to make sure that you flip these over. You do not want them to burn. Tip for today is we using spice jars as I always like to do and as you can see this was originally a spice jar. You just take the label off and you add like and another tip which you guys don't, may not know is you don't always need to have leftover ramen packets. You just open it up, which this one is already previous opened, and you add your seasoning into there and place your cap on. And voila, but make sure you put a label around it. And this also works great for sugar or flour, just or whatever. Make up your own seasoning. And there you go. Especially with the um being a vegetarian and uh, sausage, they can tend to become quite rubbery due to the fact that due to the fact that they are made out of uh, tofu, and tofu is kind of spongy itself. That's why you make sure you want to flip them, and you don't want to overcook them. And then from there, after you have them cooked. You transport them into uh, the colander. Yeah, the best way to 
grab a guest at any outing or whatever is to make these um, corn dog veggie bites or if you're not a vegetarian um, you can make these bites with using any type of sausage that you have and serve them at whatever gathering. Thank you for watching and hope to see you guys again on Living Better Cafe. Until then, see you guys later.